guys and welcome back to my channel thank you all so much for coming and clicking on the video today i went to walmart and i tried to finish that uh dublin ten dollar bonus i had to get 40 rebates so with all this i finally reached it and then i also have some um clearance stuff just the two little unicorns i did pick up three but one is for my daughter and it's already like with her or whatever and again the walmart in my area is still under construction so it's pretty loud in there so that's why we will not be in store but i'm gonna go over all the prices for everything and how the deals worked out so let's go ahead and get started with that all right so first things we're gonna go over are these traditional teas and here's the breakdown these are 478 at my store so times two it's gonna be 956 you're gonna pay that in store you're gonna submit to Ibotta for 10 cents back for uh, any kombucha, I think it was, rebate. And then you're gonna submit to Swagbucks for 800 points, which is equivalent to $8. So making these two just $1.48 or 73 cents each. Now, I felt like that was a good deal and it helped me get towards that um, bonus of $10. So that's why I picked those up. Now, I did pick up three hair colors. So this um, Clairol Natural Instant hair dye is $6.92 at my store. You're going to pay $6.92. Submit to Ibotta for $2. And there was another rebate for $3. So that counts towards two rebates, making the final cost just $1.92. We Clairol Root Touch Up. This was $5.84 at my store. You're going to pay that in store. Submit to Ibotta for $2.50. And then another rebate is attaching for $3.50. Making this one free and a $0.16 cent money maker. Now the Clairol Nice and Easy. This one is $6.92 at my store. You're going to pay that in store. Submit to Ibotta for $3 back. And another rebate for $2 back. Making that just $1.92. And then there was um, a bonus um, rebate for when you purchase two Clairol, you get a dollar back. So I did get a dollar back. So it made these cheaper. Now this Degree Men's Bar Soap and then these Degree Women's Body Wipes. So the wipes are $5.97. The bar soap is $2.97. Um, I used a $2 off coupon for the wipes from coupons.com and then so in store i paid 6.94 on ibotta there's a two dollar rebate for the wipes and then a dollar rebate for the bar and then you're going to submit your receipt to the coupons.com app for a dollar back for the bar and then shopkick is given 760 points back which is equivalent to three dollars and four cents that is scan kicks and then bonus kicks for purchasing both of these. And then I had an any soap I bought a rebate for 10 cents. So with all that, that brought my total down to free and a 20 cent money maker for the both of these. Now these Gerber teaser wheels, these are $1.96. You're gonna pay that in store, submit to Ibotta for $1.50 back, making the final cost just 46 cents. Now we're going to do the Degree Women's Body Spray and the Men's Degree Body Spray, or Dry Spray, sorry. So these are each $4.97 at my store. The total is going to come out to $9.94 for the both of them. You're going to use a $2 off coupon from the 314 Unilever for the women's and another $2 off coupon from the 314 Unilever for the men's, bringing your total down to $5.94. You're going to submit your receipt to Ibotta for $1.25 back for the women's and then another $1.25 back for the men's, two different rebates. And you're going to submit your receipt to Shopkick for 750 points back. That is scan and bonus points, which is equivalent to $3, making the final cost just $0.44 cents for the both of them or $0.22 cents each. The Focus and Fit Aid are the same rebate. So these are each $2.98. 248 at my store you're gonna pay that in store get a two dollar rebate back from ibotta making these just 44 48 cents each for the this dove bar soap this is 97 cents at my store you're gonna pay that in store submit your receipt to shopkick for 460 points 
and that is scan and bone or and purchase point that is equivalent to $1.84 making the final cost free and the 84 cent money maker well, I guess it's more I did my math wrong it's a little more than 84 cents it's an 87 cent money maker and then also just to keep in mind for the Dove uh, bar soap, you have to scan one of the um, bigger packs, like a, a three pack or six pack to get the scan points. But when you purchase this, it's still going to give you the points for buying it. Now for the Pepsis, I grabbed three of them in total. So these are $2.74 at my store. You're going to pay that in store, get a $2 rebate back from my bought it, making them just $0.74. Cents. And for these, I feel like that is an amazing deal. And so now for these two M&Ms, these are each 88 cents at my store, so times two is $1.76. You're going to pay that in store. Submit your receipt to the coupons.com app for 50 cents back when you buy two. And then also submit your receipt to Ibotta for 50 cents back. Also, you have to buy two to get that rebate back, making the final cost 76 cents or just 38 cents each. And again, I really like that deal because I... These are my preferred M&Ms. Now for these Annie's um, shell and white cheddar macaroni and cheese things. These are 97 cents at my store. So times two is $1.94. You're going to use the 50 cent off coupon from coupons.com. Submit your receipt to Ibotta for 20 cents back for each one. So a total of 40 cents back. And then also on my Ibotta, I had an any pasta rebate for 10 cents. So with all those, that brought my final cost to $0.94 cents for the both of them, or just $0.47 cents each. Now for these Shea Moisture Body Washes. These are each ninety. These are each $7.97 at my store, so times 2 is going to bring your total to $15.94. You're going to use the $5 off coupon from the 314 Unilever, pay $10.94 in store, get $2 back from Ibotta for each one, so a total of $4 back. And then submit your receipt to Shopkick for 1,200 points back, which is equivalent to $4.80, making the final cost $2.14 or $1.07 each. And there are um, scan points, but I already scanned them the first time I did this deal and it didn't reset for me. So that's why I didn't have those points. But if you still have the scan points, this will be a little bit cheaper for you. So these Friskies little grillers. These are, or this is 94 cents at my store. There's a 10 cent I bought a rebate for any cat food. And then you're going to submit your receipt to Shopkick for 145 points back. That is scan and purchase points, which is equivalent to 58 cents, making your final cost just 26 cents. Now for this Bumblebee uh, tuna salad to go pack. This is a dollar at my store. Submit your receipt to Ibotta, get 25 cents back. Making the final cost for this just 75 cents. And now for the Suave Men 2-in-1. These are $1.52. You're going to use a $1.50 off coupon from the 314 Unilever. Pay $0.02 cents in store. Submit to Fetch Rewards for a dollar back for each one. Making the final cost free. And a $0.98 cent money maker. And also, just to keep in mind, my Fetch Rewards doesn't automatically automatically catch this i have to like correct the receipt because it says any hair product and this is technically hair it just also includes body so just keep that in mind when if you do this deal then also another deal i did but um they're in the freezer right now um i grabbed some great value frozen berries for 2.47 so um, you're going to pay that in store, submit your receipt to Shopkick for 720 points back, which is equivalent to $2.88. And the points is scan and purchase points. So making your final cost for, for the frozen berries free and a $0.41 cent money maker. And now for these little unicorn things. These are so cute. They gallop and roll. I love this. I think my daughter is going to have so much fun. Anyways. So, um, originally I just saw one and it was kind of just like the little baby toy section was kind of like toys were scattered everywhere. And I've been wanting to get one of these things for my daughter since she's crawling. And, um, at my husband's family's house, they have 
They don't have this one, but they have like a little B one that rolls around and she likes that. Anyways, this was the only one like by itself. So I decided to scan it just to see the price. So I pulled my phone out, scanned it on the app and it was $5. And then I grabbed it, of course, put it in my cart. And then I, I was looking around to see what else there, there was. And then there was two more kind of like on the bottom shelf. So I grabbed... I obviously grabbed those two. That was a super cool surprise. I'm super happy and I hope my daughter loves it. So again, guys, here's everything I ended up picking up. And so my final cost for everything, minus the two little um toys, all this stuff over here and the frozen berries, my total came out to $92.32. That is before any coupons. I had a total of $14.50 in coupons. I got a total of $50.65 from Ibotta. That's bonus points and regular rebates. I got a total of $8 back from Swagbucks, $1.50 from coupons.com, $2.21 from Fetch Rewards, and a total of $16.14 from Shopkick. So with all of that, my final cost for everything was free and a $0.68 cent money maker. I know that's not a big money maker, but um, I'm I'm extremely happy just to get everything for free. I think that's super awesome. You honestly can't beat that. For me, as long as everything was free, I'm still super happy with it. You know, it's it's. I feel like couponing. It's a little tough when you see all these YouTubers making a whole bunch of money and doing this, this, and that, and you go in and you're just like, well, how do they do all that? Like, but honestly, I feel like. As long as you you save some money, like if you're if you're saving money to begin with, it's it's I feel like it's still great. I mean, you don't always have to make money. You don't always have to get everything for free. If it costs you like five, ten bucks, that still would have been a super good deal. So I feel like really you just got to take into consideration how much you actually save. Like, like, for example, just this right here, it originally cost ninety two dollars. And I got it for free. But even if I paid like ten bucks, I would have been I wouldn't have been too too mad at it. I mean, I'm so used to to getting things for free, I guess, because we've been so spoiled. But like don't don't ever feel discouraged when you guys don't make money or get it for free. You're gonna keep learning and getting better at this, so just just keep trying. I mean, you eventually get there. And like I said, don't as long as you're not paying like 20 bucks out of pocket every time. I mean, Walmart, you got to pay a lot out of pocket, but you get all the money back. But the moral of my story is never feel discouraged when you f trying to compare yourself to other couponers. Do what you can, and that's all you can do. Honestly, you can turn around and sell everything for more and make more money. So, yeah, I mean, either way, it's going to be... You're all doing good. I'm proud of all of you. All right, that's it for me, guys. Thank you all so much for coming by and clicking on the video and watching what I do. I appreciate all of you so much. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you guys enjoy. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a good night. Bye.